your Storm Team 18 forecast. Weather from where you live. We'll have a lot of cloudiness uh, tomorrow and Friday. You can see the clouds here and there will be a few light to isolated spotty showers around. Not a big deal, but a few of them just kind of speckled around the area. And then this, all this sun, this is what we've got for the upcoming weekend. So a nice weekend is ahead, but tomorrow it's going to feel more like September. It's 60s in the morning, but 72 in the afternoon, mostly cloudy, kind of breezy, a couple isolated, very spotty light showers around with highs anywhere from the 70 at Winnemac and Monticello to the 75 at Petersburg and 73 at Frankfurt. Similar on Friday, mostly cloudy, a few isolated to light spotty showers, still a little bit breezy, 59 in the morning and a High of 72 degrees with only 69 though at Logansport to the 73 Attica. Pine Village about 73, uh, around Rainsville about 73 degrees. From uh, friends down in Clarks Hill, Stockwell over here to Fickle about 71 for your high. So note the clouds right here coming in tonight. You notice an isolated shower or two even tomorrow morning and then the clouds tomorrow midday. A few isolated to spotty light showers around that's noon. This is around 5 o'clock tomorrow evening, so still the cloudiness and a couple light speckles on the radar. And then even into tomorrow night and Friday, this is Friday afternoon, the clouds around and a few little light showers here and there. And then eventually we'll get a clearing trend from northwest to southeast Friday night. But Saturday will still be a partly cloudy day with just cumulus clouds on uh, over the sky, but nice and comfortable at 75 to 80 for your high temperature. Sunday looks good too. You know, Sunday, a lot of sun, a few fair weather cumulus clouds and high temperatures near 80 degrees. But the wind will eventually turn to the south and southwest by late Monday Mon and into Monday night. And we could have a late shower on Monday as the clouds increase and then a scattering of showers and a few thunder showers on Tuesday with highs in the 70s. Now then the front goes through, um, you know, we may have a lot of clouds next Wednesday with a shower or two, but a week from this Friday and Saturday, the weather does look good. What we will be watching though is whatever is happening down in the southern and western Gulf of Mexico because there still could be a tropical system that evolves here that impacts uh, Mexico or perhaps Texas. And then we watch this hurricane right here that could very well impact Bermuda in a big way. Now there's a narrow window here for this to try to move up towards Massachusetts. But the latest trends are that it will begin to turn towards the U.S. and then turn out to sea. We'll keep a close eye on it because that could be a big, big hurricane there. Uh, but the trend is for it to veer like that. And for us, no big impacts from any of these tropical systems, it appears right now. Now, in your 10-day outlook, it's a 72 tomorrow. It's a 72 Friday, upper 70s on Saturday cool on Sunday morning with a 52 and 80 in the afternoon, 80 on Monday, a late shower or two that'd be in the evening and then a scattering of showers and thunder showers with 70s on Tuesday, a lot of clouds an isolated shower or two on Wednesday. And then we look ahead. We look to day eight highs in the 70s and then day nine and 10. This is a week from this Friday and Saturday. We start to see a warm up. We're around 80 on Friday and then we're back into the low to mid 